I wish to begin my speech at this historic session. As Prajatavi, Bhatma Vibhushan, late Sri Kaloji Narayana Rao Garu wished, Moodu Kotla, Meti Prajala, Gunthu Kokati, Kori Kokati, Telangana Velasi, Nilichi, Falinchale, Bharatana. My hearty congratulations and best wishes to the Honorable Chairman, Telangana State Legislative Council, and Honorable Speaker, State Legislative Assembly, and the Honorable Members of the Legislative Council and Assembly. My congratulations also go to the Legislative Assembly members who won the recently concluded elections with the people's affection and support and who have assumed their duties. My congratulations to all the new ministers. I am happy to see the new cabinet. The cabinet is a judicious combination of experience and the new and is led by a young leader. I am of firm opinion that the combination of youth and experience in the cabinet would fulfill its promises and reach its goal. My congratulations to the newly formed cabinet. I sincerely wish that your journey in the service of the people will be fruitful, full of contentment and victorious throughout your term of the office. Very soon, we, we are ushering in New Year, in the New Year, 2023, will remain in history as the year that has brought a new beginning to Telangana's journey. People are experiencing the change already. I am happy to inform you that the fruits of change will reach the people in full measure in the new year. Our government is taking steps to give freedom, liberty, equal opportunities, and social justice to people along with making governance within the reach of each and every citizen. I am sure the state will treat the path of success, progress, and bring light to the lives of farmers, women, youth, and the poor. People in Telangana state have given a clear verdict to liberate themselves from the 10 years of repression in the recently concluded elections. Their message is clear and loud. I appreciate the collective wisdom of the people. Telangana is breathing fresh air of freedom and liberty now. Telangana is liberated from autocratic rule and dictatorial tendencies. The people's verdict unequivocally stated that it would not tolerate any repression. This verdict became a cornerstone for civil rights and democratic rule. The iron barricades that divided the rulers from the people have been dismantled. I feel proud to say that the glass houses and the obstacles have been removed and the true people's governance has begun.